So, it's time to finish it. My Stealth Cruiser Type C layout has managed to make it all the way to the last sector, the last stand. I'm starting here, boss is over there. My ultimate goal is to stop the boss, but um, what can I say about this, uh, this sort of ship at the moment? Basically, I'm a little bit worried about my drone supply, and at the same time with this ship that I'm playing, um, I'm a little bit worried, I guess, about like my firepower. This isn't like the last uh, stealth cruise I sort of had, which had fairly decent firepower, and even though I've got drones on this ship, um, they're still a little bit lacking. I need to uh, buff up this ship a little bit before, before I basically make it to the boss. Even my engines and other stuff aren't that great, so we, we have a few things to work with here. So, we'll get to it. First things first, you have to go to this sector because it's, you know, on the way. Blah blah, blah. under fire control, a small scout has slipped through the fleet. Alright, so in this fight I've got a drone, he's got drones, as you can see. He's also got ions, halberd beam, and this. I also know I've got very weak shields for the boss fight, so... That will also have to rectify. Alright, what I want to do here. Um, so, first things first, I gotta, you know, sort of defend myself. I also know I really have to get myself an error. Um, drone, basically. Drone system here. Okay, we're gonna activate both of these. So this will be like, you know, a very, you know, interesting, very fight, so to speak. I'll have to upgrade my weapons sometime too. There's lots basically to upgrade on the ship still. So this is a very, you know, um, shall I say it's not fully upgraded ship. I really need to do more work to get going. And I haven't done enough, enough work to get going. Alright, well let's see here. Um, I suppose I should probably uh, send a hacking drone to his piling perhaps. And then this last point can just go wherever for now. I guess we'll put in Clone Bay, I guess, just so I can clone my guys if for some reason they die. And that guy, of course, misses the combat drone. Because that's what I need. Alright, how do I want to do this? So I've got myself a combat drone here and this guy there just to try and deal with the, the you know, defenses part of his uh, plan. Wondering how I'm going to do with this guy, though. To be honest, I don't really have um, very good firepower to sort of take this guy on. Okay, I think we're going to wait here a little bit. I'm just going to... Maybe cloak in a little bit. We're going to let this guy try and, you know, kill some stuff first. There goes the halberd beam. This cloak. And good, you took that guy out. Um, I'm gonna basically do this now. So yeah, another trauma bar. This is basically the thing about the ship. I've already used three, four drone parts to uh, start this battle off, just in this one fight. So drone parts, you know, there's something I, I like use like candy, so to speak. I don't really have a whole lot of candy left. Okay, I want to hack. We're just gonna fire everything. And I'm gonna fire this, I don't know, at the weapons. Actually, no, we're gonna fire this at the shields. Shields are more important to hit because um, if I knock down his shields, I don't want to worry so much about his shields. Obviously. Well, I hit his drone control, so that's done. Now I gotta deal with this, but it's got the super shield, so it's fine for a moment. There goes my shields because, um, or my super shield. Let's see here. I'm going to keep this Comet Drone going on just because he seems to be keeping the shields down for a little bit here. And if I'm lucky, I might be able to use that to my advantage. In a moment. Nope, he missed. Too bad. 
Too bad. Um, what to do then? Well, I guess we'll keep them going on just because I'm about to fire off again, so... Fire these at shields. And of course, everything missed. And I've got um, both these drones I guess, going back on, but only one of them is active at the moment. So yeah, this guy's only got four drone control at the moment on his ship, so one of the advantages of that is that I can basically... I could go with the anti-drone for a moment and maybe deal with this guy if I want to. Oh, perfect. The Hellgreen just came on right at the perfect time there. And then the iron basically knocked me down a little bit. Okay, you go in here. I just lost my flat can at the most inopportune time. System broken, I can't fire that, so that kind of sucks. Let's get all these guys to repair weapons as quickly as possible. I'll take that one hit there. That's fine. I was thinking about using cloaking for a, for a bit there, but I decided not to. That doesn't hit anything important, so we don't really care about that iron blast. Oh! My guy in the shields took a hit. Alright. Flak goes here. I fake this now. Yes, we took at least one shield pip. So that's been done, and this guy's been weakened a little bit now. Okay, if that hits engines, I'll be in a little bit of trouble, I think. And the beam drum being a, you know being around at the moment is kind of being an issue as well. I am tempted to cloak right now. Give myself just a little bit of uh, breathing room. Just a little bit. Well, I got both shield pips, and this is, you know, the shields are somewhat down. If I'm lucky, I can, like, go like this, maybe? And knock down a shield a bit more. He's down to two pips, so that's not bad. There goes my, goes my drone control, so I just lost both my drones there for a bit, but oh well. I'm gonna deal with that. They somewhat did their job already, so. Okay, hey, the shields are down to one pip. He's being torn apart, at least. It's not being torn apart fast enough, but he's being torn apart. Hmm. Let's cloak to avoid those IM shots for a moment. The good thing is that he's only got this drone going on, so that's actually really helping a lot in this battle. It's actually really lucky to have that going on. So I'm just going to leave him alone, not use the anti-drone for a little bit. That won't hurt me. Okay, we're going to fire this at the shields again. We'll fire this as weapons, hopefully. We heal shields there, I think, once, so that'll help. Oh, he repaired his drone systems. Not that it's going to help him too much. He's almost on his last legs here, so... 
This is fire. Fire. He's gone. So we got one drone part, um, part back for this battle, but as you can see, this ship is it's a little bit uh, difficult to sort of fight with it at the moment. I really need to get more drone parts and stuff like that to sort of like fight this um, battle that I'm going to be into. I might go that uh, repair in a little bit. But I'm actually also thinking about going to this store here as well. This right now is to buy stuff. I think we'll just bolt toward the boss for now. So, space station, blah, blah, blah. So I can get myself two drone parts. Oh, backup DNA would be nice. I'll note that on my uh, ship, I don't have a whole lot of uh, augments either. So, in many ways, this ship is really underpowered, but there's a lot of stuff that I can do to improve it before the boss fight here. I want to store rather. Getting this would help a lot. So we're gonna get that. And then we'll get two more combat drones. And then we'll start booking it toward the boss here. He's gonna hit that repair there apparently real quick, so that kinda sucks, but oh well. Let's go here. So blah blah, blah I get some more drum parts. And yeah, sadly he's going to be going right there, so... I guess the first battle is going to begin, whether I like it or not, right now. Which sucks, but oh well. Um, I can upgrade my weapons before fighting this guy, so I can get all these things at least on. And hope for the best. This is it, the rail sh fl flagship is here. Hacking drone goes off. He cloaks. We're gonna use this. Gonna charge that up. I think I'll have to use the comet drone in this one, so. We're gonna do this. And that's gonna kind of suck for, you know, this battle if he hits my, uh, weapons. So I got no weapons at the moment. Okay, what do I want to hit on him? What on him scares me the most? Yeah, this is gonna suck because I don't really have the sort of, uh, defenses or firepower to really deal with him. We'll have to try. So, there goes his uh, evasion, I guess. Don't want to try and dodge all that. Yeah, I do want to dodge that. Oh! Well, there goes the super shield. He took a hit. Maybe I shouldn't have used the cloaking there because that guy would have absorbed a hit. The super shield would have absorbed a hit. And I only would have been hit by one missile. But, well, there's, you know, too much of a risk. Alright, we're going to... After this, I want to hit his, um, what? These two right here are the main threats. These are also big threats for, you know, this battle. Then, of course, there's shields. But this guy can fix his shields, so... That's a, that's a thing to really worry about. This is the thing about this fight. There's really no good strategy to sort of beat this guy. With this ship. Fire D's at him. Okay, the mini beam's capable of being used here, so.
I have three systems of a fire like this, and I'll take that weapon down one, the hacking one. That'll do a little bit of damage. So we did at least a couple hits there with the mini beam, and that's been damaged, and this has been damaged with a fire. That's a fairly good starting attack. Okay, there goes that. I guess the guy's still stuck in hacking, or something. Yeah, he's stuck in hacking, he can't get in there. So interesting enough, that's uh, this hacking thing is on regardless of whether um, uh, I'm using the thing or not. There goes another drone part to activate this guy, sadly. There goes two hits. One gets my slug man over here, one that's in the middle of nowhere. Hmm. Irons I don't like. But I mean, I could dodge the irons, but what would be the purpose of it? Gonna fire my flak and my other stuff in a moment. So I hit my shield once there, that's gonna hurt, but I mean, it won't kill me. Let's fire the flak again right there. And maybe I should be going after the, the guy here, just, you know, just so he gets damaged. I hit him with the mini beam, he gets damaged. I don't think I'll reach this guy too, but what I could do is just go like this. And maybe get the shields too. I'll actually go like this instead if that's what I'm going to do, just to hit the shields first. Yes, there we go, I hit the shields once. So we'll be fixing that a little bit, and we darn the three pips. Okay, there goes those. There goes one hit there. I'll let these hits come at me. I realize I just knocked off my mini beam, but it's just a mini beam. I won't worry about it too much. I'm already losing my weapons anyway, so no big deal. Yeah, I'll let those hits come too. Oh, he hit that. Hacking's been hit. I lost hacking. Hmm. So if you go this way instead, I only have two of those guys going there because they'll get locked inside and then they won't be able to go elsewhere. I'll have the energy stick out because he can repair stuff outside. Will be the plan with him. There goes those missiles again. And... We're gonna cloak for those missiles. Take those misses. Alright, I don't have the mini beam right now. But I am tempted to fire, but I, I'm going to wait for the mini beam to charge up. I'm surprised I still have the mini beam on the ship. I don't usually keep mini beams this long around. Halberd beam fired there. Um, fired this guy. I want to keep. I want to try and kill this guy as a thing. So. Hacking one off right then and there. I can't fire those off. And I cloaked too, so I mean, oh well. Nothing good about that instance right there. Can't dodge those missiles, so those are gonna hit. 
Ouch. Do I want to dodge those laser shots? Now nah, we won't worry about them. So holds down to 75%, that's going to hurt a little bit. Get that going. Get back out there. You go to doors. If I'm lucky, I'll be able to hit this guy. Hey, I hit him once, so that's done. It's gonna suck down get hit by his missiles, though. I can't really dodge him in any shape or form. There goes my hacking again. Still don't have doors. There goes my weapons, you know. This isn't exactly a fun fight. Do this. Oh, my drones are gonna get hit. Oh, I guess I lucked out of how we didn't go that far. Those are slowly charging up and finally able to fire them all in the volley once more. Only bad thing is that this isn't fixed. Okay, there we go. I can get that going. All right. Um. I'm gonna wait for the drone to make at least someone over to here. Fire everything. And then. Well, that's a little bit more damage. Just before my, you know, weapons went off the line yet once more. Apparently those ions hit my shields, so that's gonna suck. Ouch. I sent them both in here. Yep, I'm not sure I'm gonna win this fight. There's just, uh... So much I sort of need to do, and so little I can do. Let's go here. And go up here. At least the layout is nice for a game my guys around the weapons bay. In this instance at least. I hit the mini beam and got killed that guy there, so at least he's finally dead. If I'm, I might be able to kill the laser before, if I survive this fight, before uh, this guy gets away. 
Of course, this all, you know, went off just right now. You get out here. Miss one of those at least. Ah. I think I'm going to dodge those missiles. I try to. That fire is spreading, sadly, so that's being an issue. Oh, you stay there, then. You just get down to here. Hopefully you can put out this fire. Damn it, I missed the cue to fire that before, you know, you did the hacking thing again. Would've been nice to get the meme beam going and hit that for at least. But at least we kill his weapons. The lasers are finally off. It's not the most perfect instance of getting rid of them, but they are off. This is kind of like the last battle where, you know, I was fighting the boss and he's, you know, just tearing me to pieces again. At least I got rid of the lasers finally in this ship. Ow, at least those guys got to repair stuff. There goes the drone bay taking a hit. He's almost dead though, so at least that's a blessing for his fight. Guess we lost a super shield drone. That'll hurt for his fight. Everything hurts in his fight. And there goes my hacking too. Or there goes their hacking too for, um, you know, the upteen time. Go here, go there. Oh, oh, more damage to my shields. Put those two in there. I'm down to two hit points, but he's like down to three, but. And there I go. So, couldn't even get through the first stage of the boss of this ship because it just didn't have the firepower or the defenses to really take him on. So, there's like the boss fight with the uh, Type C stealth ship. I didn't make it through, didn't get through the first fight. So, that wise, I didn't come really anywhere close to the other ships I've been playing with. I'm wondering if like the game got a lot harder with the advanced edition stuff. And not, not just being like the boss here, but just like the general um, difficulty raising slightly with like less scrap and stuff like that. Anyhow, that'll be it for this run with the uh, Type C ship. I'll basically probably jump into maybe showing off finally the uh, um, new ships, the Lanius craft here. Just to show it off. It doesn't actually, you know, have like, you know, the uh, two versions of it, but basically I can still show off Type A and Type B of it, so there's that. Sometimes I'll have to unlock all this other stuff.
All right, well, see you guys next time. Take care.